Hello everyone, Sludgy Cool here, and today I'm back with another Minecraft building time lapse. Today we're going to be building a relatively small coal mine in a giant tank of iron. Plus, I would highly advise sticking around till the end of the video because I have an interesting surprise planned for an upcoming video. Let's get started. To begin, I use a world edit brush to convert all the pods in the area to grass. Once this is done, I do a few more minor pieces of terraforming before building the shaft that will go deep into the earth where the mining tunnels are. After I've created the main shaft, I test a few different support designs before eventually setting on one that I like. Then I replicate this design going down that side of the shaft, afterwards copying and pasting it into the other sides as well. Then, I create a diary to insight to stone to cobblestone variant going down the shaft. Once this is complete, I begin working on a hoist mechanism to move the platform that the miners will take into the mine up and down. Once this is done, I decide to add two small shacks that would act as areas for the miners to live. After this, I add a few carts that could be used to transport coal to and from the mine. Then, I use world edit to add path and cobblestone blocks to make it look like the area has been moved around. Then, I add a few custom trees dotted around the area. Once I've added the trees, I use stone and stone stairs to create cliffs going around the perimeter of the valley containing the mine. Now there is a quite specific strategy I use for creating this cliffs. First, I go around and create a few layers of stone, slowly getting higher as you go back with spikes in it. Then, I use stairs to make it smoother and remove some of the spikes. Once the general outline of the cliffs is done, I use world edit to convert it to a mixture of stone, andesite, cobblestone, and mossy cobblestone. And then I use tegel leaves as bushes and bone meal to create a more overgrown feel in the area. After this, I decide to work more on the interior of the mine. To begin, I create a sm somewhat decent sized shaft coming out the side of the main shaft about halfway down, using spruce supports and torches to make it seem like it has been used a lot. Then I go to the very bottom and create a similar shaft. I also use gravel on the floors to make it look as if the, there is loose rock that has been mined out and walked around on. Once the bottom shaft is complete, I decide to return to the one about halfway up the shaft and add a second tunnel branching off where more coal could be mined, as well as a small area in the back of the cave where something other than coal has been revealed. Um, once the interior of the mine is complete, I add small blackstone chimneys to the two hot houses for the miners. Afterwards, I move on to making the area around the entrance to the mine a little bit more pretty. First, I extend the path some more, as well as adding a pond and small creek leading out of the pond at the exit of the mine. And then I add another clump of spruce bushes as well as grass. Lastly, I add decent sized roots to the two trees near the exit of the mine. Now, with this all complete, let's see some cinematic shots of the finished build.
Now, with the video nearing its end, I would like to reveal the surprise that I discussed earlier. I plan on in the next few weeks beginning a Let's Play in 1.18. This will be heavily focused on building, and I am very excited to add a new kind of content to the channel. If you are excited and looking forward to that, please leave a like on the video and subscribe. See you next time!